Since Repair Clinic encourages you to perform repairs safely, a warning icon will appear when you should use caution. As part of the heating system, the furnace's draft inducer fan motor draws air into the burner assembly, where the air allows the burners to warm the heat exchanger. The air within the burner assembly is then exhausted to the outside of the home, which is necessary since this air contains toxic fumes such as carbon monoxide. As a safety precaution, a pressure switch or a flame rollout limit switch will stall the ignition sequence if the draft inducer fan motor malfunctions. A noisy furnace is often a strong indicator that the fan motor is wearing out. Draft inducer fan motors are usually unique to each furnace model. You should enter the full model number of your furnace in our website search bar to find the specific fan motor you need. Before you replace the fan motor, first turn off the power to the furnace. We recommend shutting off the gas supply as well. The draft inducer fan motor is normally located in the combustion chamber, close to the venting. To reach it, you will need to uninstall the upper access panel. Detach the exhaust vent from the outlet port of the draft inducer assembly. The venting may be secured with mounting screws or a clamp. Detach the pressure switch vacuum tube. Then uninstall the pressure switch or switches if required. Disconnect the motor wires. You may need to detach a grounding wire as well. Unthread the mounting screws, securing the old draft inducer fan motor assembly. Pull the old assembly free. When installing a new draft inducer fan motor, you may need to transfer certain components, like the vacuum tube, from the old assembly to the new one. Position the new assembly on the plenum. Or, if applicable, on the condensate pan. Thread the mounting screws to secure. Connect the motor wires. Secure the grounding wire if required. Reinstall the pressure switch or switches as necessary. Reattach the pressure switch vacuum tube. Reattach the exhaust vent and secure it as required. With the new draft inducer fan motor installed, replace the access panel. Turn the gas supply back on, as well as the power, and your furnace should be ready for use.